Hi guys, Ace Face back with another video for you today. I'm going to talk a little bit about the Las Vegas Open 2018. I am going to be going. This is more of an announcement video more than anything, but I'm going to talk a little bit about what's going on um, and what to expect from it. Before I jump in to details about what I'm going to be doing at the Las Vegas Open, um, I just want to say if you want to support me, then do click the um, subscribe button. It helps me tons. And also, if you can hit the bell button, then you'll get a notification when I drop a video. You can also follow me on Instagram. I post loads and loads of work in progress pictures. So if you like to see what's on the hobby desk and what's going on, that's probably where I'm most active. You can also catch me on my Facebook page where I'll put announcements and what have you. You'll also get up-to-date details when Wargamer Weekly is going to hit, if it hits that week. You'll see it all at the Facebook page. You can also follow me on Twitter as well. Not very active active there but if you're if you're into your Twitter you can catch me there um, and if you'd like to support me further and really help out what I do on the channel um, you can support me through Patreon um, and going forward I'm having a bit of a push on Patreon um, from now on every single backer will have their name at the end of the video uh, at the moment I have one loyal Patreon um, backer who is Rob um, and he is an absolute legend, but we've had some really cool backers this year. People have dipped in and dip out, and that's absolutely cool. You guys have helped me out tons, um, so thank you so much. And yeah, if you want to support me, do jump over to Patreon and support me there. Um, there's some there's some new t-shirts that are on the way. So I've got the artist that does all the artwork for the... Um, Northwest Open, the last chance open, Jojo is making some exclusive Ace Face custom t-shirts. They're going to be very, very cool. Um, I'm not going to spoil too much, but they're going to be something a little bit different rather than just a symbol. They should be really, really cool t-shirts that hopefully people will want to pick up. At first, they will be exclusive to my Patreon um, followers and my Patreon um, contributors. Um, so you can check them out there. The dice, we've got some new dice that are on their way with the new updated emblem, so they'll be available again to Patreon account um, backers and loads of other good stuff too. But if there's other things I'm missing out on Patreon and you want to kind of um, you want to support, but there's some perks you could suggest, then absolutely get in, get in touch. Let me know what it is that I'm missing out on because um, you know that really does help me bring this hobby to the next level. So so that's Patreon. That's what's going on. That's how to follow me. Now onto this video about the Las Vegas Open 2018. Right, so I'm going to Las Vegas Open 2018. Um, I am very excited about it. It is now less than three weeks away, um, so I'm absolutely buzzing, cannot wait. It's going to be amazing. Uh, the best thing about it is always just catching up with people, particularly catching up with people from over the pond that I don't get an opportunity to see face to face, just talk to them over the internet, and it's going to be great to kind of catch up with them again, drink a beer, and have a laugh. Um, so many cool people are going to be there. It is a who's who of Wargamers, so it's it's a great place to kind of meet um, so many wicked people. If you are coming along, um, please do catch up and say hello, um, come over, um, have a chat. That's kind of what I enjoy most, just networking with people and just you know just seeing what what people have got to say, what they like, what they dislike. You know, just so just come, pop over, say hello. Um, I'll be there from the Wednesday afternoon and I'll be there all the way through till the Monday afternoon. So yeah, come over and, and, and say hello. It'd be great to kind of meet you and uh, you know, maybe drink a beer, see how we get on. Um, so that's that's kind of, of, of what, what I'm going to be doing off the table. But I will be entering in the, a, the 40k champions. Um, what's, 40k championship the 40k championship which is the big event um, it is now 500 player strong which is the record so it will be the biggest ever singles 40k event in the world which is incredible amazing so it's grown like about an extra 150 people from last year which just shows the power of 8th edition um, and just so excited to get involved in it so I'm going that I am going to be bringing my Tyranids. I kind of roll my eyes because I'm still, 
I'm drawn so much guys, I'm drawn so much, so please do put your comments down below because you probably could sway me, I'm that much still on a knife edge. I love the Tyrions, I want to bring them, I've got a list I think that will do really really well, it's been effective in practice, I love it, it's fun, it's awesome, but I am so, so drawn by the by the demons, and I'll tell you why. I took the I took my demons list to the Scottish Open two or the Scottish Takeover two, sorry, um, and came second, and they performed incredibly well, incredibly well. Uh, Mortarian is such a fun unit to play with. The plague bearers were so resilient. It was just the the list worked so effectively well, um, and with the new demon codex. I can tell you what that list with slightly t sl a few tweaks that I've had to kind of that I'm going to have to do to it. Um, it's incredible, guys. It's off the scale. It's dare I say it? It's good enough to win the whole thing. It's that good. Um, I'm going to throw it out there. I personally think it is. It's an incredibly strong list. Do I think that I will enjoy it as much as the Tyranids? Probably not, but I do like to win and I do like to play hard. So at the moment it's the Tyranids, it's definitely the Tyranids I'm taking, but I tell you what, I could be swayed so easily, so easily. So let me know what you think guys, tell me in the comments, what should I bring, should I be loyal to High Fleet Vora, or should I take Mortarian and the Plague Bearers? Potentially some other guests, who knows, chuck in Maggie, who knows, who knows. But look, that list is... They're, with a few tweaks, that list is ready to take the world on. The Tyranids, they're good, they're solid. How far I can push them, I'm not too sure, but they're, they're still going to do well. I'm looking to do well this year. I want to do better than I've done before, um, and fingers crossed, either of the two lists I bring will do that. But that Demon list could be top tier, guys. It literally could be top tier. But, you know, who knows? Who knows? What should I do? Tell me. I need to know. Um, so that's that's the event. And, yeah, other than that, looking forward to just really hanging out. Vegas is a wicked place to go. I just love it. It's a great getaway. Um, I have been very fortunate this year that my lovely, kind, beautiful, amazing wife has decided that she is going to let me go on my own with friends. Which means that um, as much as we've had a ball the last couple of years, we've done a lot of shows, we've done a lot of Vegas when I've had spare time not playing. This year I will be completely you know, immersing myself in the world of 40k, in the world of the Las Vegas Open. So I'm going to have a lot more time to really kind of take in and experience the con, which I'm really excited about because... I didn't have that opportunity really the last couple of years. Pretty much, I was on the tables, then I was off, then I was out doing other things in Vegas. So this time I'm going to get an opportunity to spend more time catching up with people um, and a lot more time just wandering in and taking in the sights and sounds of the Las Vegas Open. And it sounds like an amazing event. So it's going to have, there's going to be lots of um, uh, seminars, there's so test, like that, so. Um, free gaming, there's you name it, and there's still events that you can get involved in if you're kind of late to it. So it's uh, yeah, if you're still sort of humming and ahhing, get yourself a com badge and come down. I think it's gonna be it's gonna be an incredible laugh. Um, so many cool people going. It's it's gonna be a ball. So in the next video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through my Tyranid list for you. I'm gonna go through. We're gonna talk about it. We're gonna pick it at, pick it apart in detail. I'm going to talk about what's good at, what's bad at, um, and and that'll be interesting. And then by that point, hopefully, I'm a bit more cemented with taking it. Um, we'll see. But hopefully, you enjoyed it. And as I said, if you're in Vegas around the Las Vegas Open, do definitely uh, pop around, say hello, say hi. Um, be great to see you. Until the next video, there, guys. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.